Hello Leo, welcome back to my channel. Thank you so much for tuning into your What Do They Regret Love reading. We are going to be having a look what this person is regretting about you, your connection and some things they may have done. This can be for Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus um, and it can be an ex, it can be someone you've recently fallen out with, it can be someone you're no, no longer in contact with um, but you might have had that strong romantic history so this reading could be helpful for you uh, don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel uh, it would really be appreciated you'll receive um, notifications of updates um, and also notifications for when readings for your sign will be coming out throughout the week as well so um, please subscribe let's jump into the reading otherwise and see what comes up leo what do they regret? What's their biggest regret? Okay, straight away I'm drawn to the fact that someone regrets moving too fast with the magician. Okay, it's a very fast-paced energy. It's also um it also can be seen as manipulation here. So there could be someone here who regrets having manipulated you into something. Uh, okay, strong notions of regret of walking away, okay, um, or saying something hurtful and then moving away. But the Five of Swords is like, you notice how he just looks back at the cards and he tries to pick up the pieces, but essentially they're walking away. So I really get the sense that someone, there's, there's a lot of regret here, Leo, that this person either walked away too soon uh, or they let ego get in the way. The magician is Aries Gemini. Possibly let ego, you know, and that little voice inside their head direct them to move away from you. Potentially they didn't work hard enough at the connection with the Eight of Pentacles. Um, and I really feel like that fast-paced vibe, uh, Leo. So this person, you know, they, they acted in haste. They said something, you know, without thinking, or they walked away without looking back, or they moved away, they moved out, they packed their things very, very quickly, okay, without having given themselves the time, without having given you time, and it's really thrown them off now, and I think they're they're looking back and they're trying to reassess where they went where they went wrong. Um, the swords is communication and thought as well, so um there's someone here who may have regret and lost um, losing touch with you. He's lost some of the swords, so there might be someone here who regrets losing your number, um, for example, or um, they regret losing touch, okay, or they regret not replying or not not truly opening up to how they they really feel. Um, I also get that there's a big regret here for working too much. Or putting, putting maybe in-laws, family members, friends, needs, wants, desires above yours, Leo. There's there's potentially regret here um, around that. Something about a family dynamic here could even be an asset. Especially with these two earth cards. If it's not an earth sign, it could indicate money. Okay, so maybe money getting into the... Um, money sort of stuffing things up a little bit either being competitive with money letting money get in the way letting greed get in the way even letting their work schedule get in the way of your relationship you know placing priority on that there could be some very big regrets um, but the magician i see the magician as the trickster and he's sort of the player okay in in the tarot deck he he does what he wants he's a free agent he, at least he acts this way or she acts this way and I think with the magician here, there may be regret that this person sort of played you around a little bit, manipulated you, um, played a few tricks on you, um, left you a little bit dazed, and at times you didn't really understand what was going on in, in this frazzled energy. Uh, and, and I think they're coming to regret that. You know, he has a serpentine uh, belt, so it's like sneaky behavior shady behavior it could be that they're coming to regret that and it was a pattern the infinity symbol i think they they did it more than once i think it happened time and time again um, but i think they're regretting it and and it may have even been to a very small scale um 
but it's still with them. It's still something that they, they very much think about. Um, now, for some of you, it's that, uh, for some, um, maybe it's that this person revealed too, too much too soon. The magician can almost be seen like revealing his secrets in this spread. So it makes me think if someone regrets revealing things about them or things about their past or their history um, to you very quickly. So maybe they didn't take their time in doing that. Or maybe they could have uh, could have addressed those things differently. Ten of Pentacles. Maybe it's like family pressure here as well. I get like children or pressure to have a family or pressure to be to fit certain roles in relationships or as parents. And um, maybe there's regret here for that. Um, in that regard, letting family get to them somehow, or their relationships with your family or your friends impact them or frustrate them. Uh, so it could be that as well. Now for some there's a third person. So there could be deception. Okay, notice there's cheating. Okay, there might be someone who regrets. Um, who regrets cheating or having another person involved. Not really a card of deception, however. So I'm not too fixated on that. But I do want to mention the art, which is a support system. It's a support network. Um, so it could be that either this person regrets being too supportive um, and you potentially shutting them th them down or it could be the other way and it's that they weren't supportive enough that they could have been more supportive emotionally, mentally, psychologically and maybe that's where they're finally coming to terms with that. I think they are confronting it. I, I, I do feel like they're still at a stage where they're looking back at things there may be someone here who wants to pick up the pieces once again, Leo, and, and sort of see where um, the two of you could, could pick up. Okay, picking up the swords is, is initiating contact, um, analyzing a situation, narrating it. Okay, so putting it as a narrative and understanding where it went wrong or what they did. Um, so I, I do feel like there's deep impact here for this person, Leo. And I think they're starting to go through all those... Um, all those sorts of things um, and, and all those sorts of emotions, I think, are, are huge for them right now. But um, I do hope this reading has been helpful. Please leave a like if you have enjoyed it. Um, don't forget to subscribe to the channel to receive notifications when readings for your sign are posted to the channel. Otherwise, I hope you have a wonderful month ahead and I'm sure we'll talk soon. So take care, Leo, and bye for now.